innovation to me has a, a core piece of the way our ecosystem and as our country evolves uh, as we progress into the 21st century. Innovation, that, like, that's our future and that is what is really going to bring us to that next level. Being in an environment where you're with other people that share your passion for starting a company, huge advantage that I would very much want to participate in. I planned a national leadership conference here at SGM last year. Uh, the theme of the leadership conference was innovation and startup uh, leadership. And as I was doing that and planning that conference, I got to go out and visit you know, places like Vidyard and Communitech and Velocity and see this cool and innovative workspace and what all these people are doing. And I thought, we need to be giving this opportunity to our high school kids. And I think we need to get away from delivering content and we need to start focusing on building those competencies that will allow kids to be successful in this future that we don't really know a lot about. I think the goal of the Innovation Lab is to give kids a chance to pursue their, their passions and their interests in a uh, in an open and creative environment. Each group will get a mentor related to the idea or the passion that they're working towards. We'll have a couple teachers in the room that are helping them through that sort of startup process. And hopefully it will all culminate where we're having a pitch night uh, in the community and with the winning group uh, having the opportunity to have an internship at the University of Laurier's launch pad for the summer. I've always liked to have a more kind of freestyle courses. I don't like too much structured work. I like it when I get a little instructions and I'm allowed to just do my own thing. And I think this course really allows that. And uh, a few of my friends and I have, uh, have many ideas that we really want to try and work on. For my undergrad degree, I want to go to uh, University of Waterloo for biomedical engineering. And I have a team put together for the Innovation Lab. And we are thinking of doing this project where we create 3D printed prosthetic hands that we can make and actually give to kids and people that need them. This is your opportunity to see what you want to do. Maybe you'll get the bug. Maybe it'll morph into something huge. Maybe this will be your life. You don't know, so why not try it out? I think it's good timing to take it in high school, like 11 or 12, um, because I know I was not really prepared for the real world in a way. So I think doing something like this could almost be like a mini co-op. Like you would get to learn from a lot of people and kind of get like the highlights of what they learned, how they failed, uh, what they did right, and without having to maybe go through it all yourself. I think collaboration is one of the most important aspects of this entire process because we have the ability to learn from others, especially others that we wouldn't have necessarily um, engaged with otherwise. You have a incredibly unique opportunity uh, to learn and absorb and to do things with your mind and with your hands that as you get older um, you start to lose because of the pressures of, of everyday life, right? You, you get a job, you get a mortgage. Um, there's all these things that contribute to um, a sense of stability but a lack of time. Where else? What other high school has entrepreneurial programming designed for that level? That is a huge leg up. I need to tackle these opportunities that are teaching me how to be innovative, how to collab with others in a world that's constantly changing. I can't stress enough how unique of an opportunity this is. There's not another school in the province that will have access to the community partners that we have. And I think that's an opportunity that really is, is special. Everyone should do their best to come out and try it out. It's going to be a lot of fun.